Hi guys and welcome to the channel. In this video we are going to talk about this wireless microphone here. I'm going to give my sort of review and opinion on it. It is the Fullaim X5. It's kind of a budget microphone but it's also sort of got quite similar specs to a DJI mic at probably about half the price. So we're going to go through things like prices and sort of sound tests as well and obviously sort of my thoughts and opinions of it. So I got this mic for £80 off Amazon. Um, it's back up, that was on like a special offer. I think it is around £100 now or $130. US. Um, what do you get then? Uh, I'm just going to show you that now. So I'm going to switch to my other camera and show you how you plug it in, uh, iPhone and everything like that. And then we go through the sound tests in a second. So basically um, what you do get is, it comes in this box here. And if you need to charge it, obviously you put this plug in right here. Oops, if it actually goes in like so. And then you put this into a USB sort of plug charger and then can charge it from then. And then basically you put your units in like so. So you just put the slot in the mic ports and then close and charge. So yeah, really sort of simple and easy to charge. So it does come with that wire. Also comes with this camera cable wire. So if you want to mount it to the top of a camera, you can do that as well. Anyway, I'm going to show you how I do mount it to the iPhone now. So I'm going to switch over to the GoPro so you can obviously see me do it on the iPhone. But yeah, it does come with a couple of other sort of things so you've got different sort of USB ones so you've got this one uh, different sort of port plugs that you can obviously attach to the mic the mic sorry and obviously plug into your phone it's very simple uh, plug and go there's no sort of faffing about installing any software so probably one of the advantages of this um, mic is no installation it is literally plug in make sure it's connected and go which is you know if you're on the go, you don't want to be faffing with all the apps. Even though I love apps, sometimes it's just like, you know, we like things simple. And this thing is for the quick and simple way. Anyway, I'm going to show you how I plug it in the iPhone now. So setting up the device is fairly easy, everyone. So I've got the receiver here. And I've got the little plug socket here for the iPhone. On the top of it, you'll see that point there, and then you basically put this in, clip like so, and then you plug it into your iPhone like this. It's ready to go. You hit the power button, it will say welcome. You turn your mic on and I'm going to just test it. Yep, so when it's testing, you should basically see on the screen, you can see the sort of lines moving uh, when I'm talking. So yeah, that's when you know the mic's working and yeah, it basically syncs with your phone at the same time, which is really great. Um, so there's sort of no faffing around syncing, Bluetooth, Bluetoothing or anything. It is literally done sort of straight away because it is in the device. So you're probably wondering what this mic does sound like outside. So what I did next was basically a sort of wind test. So I went out on like a really sort of blowy, windy day, quite sort of high up on the South Downs, just to see. This is me talking without the microphone. So you're probably hearing quite a lot of wind interference here, to be honest with you. And this is a test with obviously the microphone on now. So yeah, just talking with the microphone on. So yeah, I think it is blocking out all the wind here. Well guys, as you probably did see, that was the sort of sound quality, the difference without the mic and with it. Obviously with the mic, it does make crystal clear even if you do have a lot of interference outside say for instance you're in traffic or you're in the windy area it does make a lot a lot of difference um, blocking out sound interference overall it's a really good starter mic to get 
Um, you know, if you're looking to spend under £100 and have a similar spec um, wireless mic that's similar to DJI, obviously it's not as good as that, you know, but it's it's good if, you know, to get started if you're vlogging and want to get serious with sort of sound, obviously sound is quite important. So yeah, it's def definitely a great starter mic to get if you want to spend sub £100, under £100 for this. Anyway, I do hope you liked my review of the device. It's great talking to everyone. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you in the next video. Bye for now.